launched an investigation into a violent gang that has been involved in murder and robbery within the county. This now has brought very high the level of insecurity in the area. Madness has overflown in the home of the late Hillary Amalemba, a 30-year-old young man who was shot dead by robbers who attacked him at his place of work. Na hao wa vile ulikuja ulikuwa wanakuja kutake it nani? Lewis. Ujikuwa court na pesa. Na hiyo pesa ulichukua, wakachukua court. Sasa vile huyu kijana alikuja kuwasaidia huyu, ndio ulilenga yeye ni risasi. Ikapita kwa mlango, paka kwa yeye. The dreaded gang is said to have gotten away with a sum of 150,000 shillings and an unknown amount of gold. This case is one of the cases of robbery that have been reported in the areas of Kaimosi, Cheptuli, Makuchi, Shaviringa and other surrounding areas. This incident is not an isolated incident. We have had similar incidents in several areas. Cheptulu, we have had it. Kaimosi, we have had it. A hotel has been raided using... Uh, the AK-47 uh, machine gun. The rise in crime in the area is due to the presence of many people in the area pursuing different activities, including the gold business and also because there are several education institutions, including Kaimosi University. Wale machambazi wanakuja usiku, wanaingilia biashara yetu. Hata mimi nimekuwa na hii shida karipu mwaka moja, walikuja kwa duka yangu, wakapumua, wakaenda na vitu. So naomba Serikali ya ukatuzi na serikali ya kitaifa mutusaidia hapa ili tufanya biashara yetu bila shida yoyote. These residents now want the government to intervene as they fear for their lives. Ni nini inafanyika? AK-47 na iwezi patikana na mutu wakawaida hapa. Tunataka wale eh, security, NIS, wale intelligence, DCI, waingia wachunguze hii maneno tujua ukweli hiko wapi. Na wasipo tuambia, sisi tunaenda kupika firimbi. The area OCPD Ruth Lagat has said that they have beefed up security in the areas prone to these attacks, especially around the